Six missed shots in a row for RGV before that one. Fields going the other direction. Throws it up to Brown. Slams it home. And this alley-oop jam. Yeah, Moses Brown coming right into your living room right there. Basketball IQ needs to improve. He continues doing that, and you can certainly see him being an NBA player for a long time. Cleveland from long range. I guess biggest takeaway from the first half really has to be the play of Moses Brown. Yeah, it's all Moses Brown inside. He got everything he wanted right at the Rio Grande Valley to start the second quarter of play. Come out firing out of the timeout. Eric Holman. Fields. Outside to Baba. Pulls up from the wing. Good. Picked up his dribble here, his double team. Horch is staying in the corner, and you got to come back and help your teammate. Give him. It's not your teammate's job just to get the pass to you. It's your job also to get open for your teammate. Horch still has not been able to. Hormix has I mean, he's not been able to check in quite yet for Brown, as there's not been a whistle for about two and a half minutes, and now there's one. This is a good place to be in Frisco, Texas, this weekend. You can take in a little bit of everything. We hope you'll be with us on Friday night right here at Comerica Center as Baba hits from three. Legends lead at six with under a minute to go now in the third quarter. That was long range. Quick release there. Fields brings it back down. Excuse me. That's on the other end. McDowell brought it down. Baba. Everybody's sinking in and sinking in and you kick it out to a wide open shooter. Far side, three good. Almost didn't even hit the backboard. Up top, alley -oop. The Texas Legends increase their lead. Pass and throw down from field, Stohor. Yeah, I know what I love about that is Moses Brown posting up in the front, drawing all the attention and allowing Horde to sneak in on the backside for the easy jam from Fields. Great play by the Legends.